We have an update now to a story we reported yesterday. Wichita's Splash Aqua Park forced to close this week after vandals destroyed half of its inflatable obstacle course. KSN Zena Taher spoke with the owners of the business new tonight about the latest string of break-ins at that location. Zena. Jeff, despite challenges, the couple operating Splash Aqua Park told me they're standing their ground. They'll reopen Friday and they don't plan on leaving anytime soon. Splash Aqua Park had a rude awakening Sunday morning. Late Saturday night, vandals stabbed holes into the inflatables at the park. For a long time, we didn't think that we were going to even be able to operate for the rest of the season. The incident destroyed half the inflatables, but it isn't the first time Splash has been targeted. Earlier this summer, um, they came through and they stole the cameras. At the start of the month, a group of teens broke into Splash and the shaved ice stand in front of the building. And just a few weeks before that, they had broken into the shaved ice stand in a separate incident. I mean, it was just malicious. The lack of, the, just the lack of respect. What you're seeing here amounts to about $85,000 worth of damage. But the Hagers say they're not going to let that stop them from reopening. We love Wichita. Wichita is where it started for us. The plan is to clean up the destroyed inflatables and reopen the undamaged half of the park starting Friday. Tickets will be half priced for the rest of the season. 2024, we're going to have a full operation going again and and continue to build on the support that we've already received. We're not going anywhere. <laughs> we're not going anywhere. The Hagers say they're less worried about break-ins happening next summer because a local security business moving into the lot plans to add more surveillance to the area. Here for you, Zena Taher, KSN News 3.